Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for dropping by. This is going to be part two of my walk around Stanley Park video and as you can see this video is starting at the exact same place as where I finished off the other one, looking through the bars here at this gate, the jetty and the lake. So let's come back through here so you can see this gate and now we're going to walk round and get back on task, getting back onto this path and get on with walking around Stanley Park. Some more small trees here that have just been built. They've got nice wooden pole supports and a nice wooden post around them to protect them. On that side we've got Sandy Park Lake, you've just seen that through the fence. On that side, we've got the zoo. I'm not going to go over there at this point and poke the camera through any fences because I did that earlier. Well, I did that last year. So if I remember and I can find it, I will link my zoo video. But you know what I'm like for forgetting to link videos, I'll probably forget. Well that is another place where I want to go. And I'm sorry about all the traffic noise, but it is what it is. East Park Drive. Super duper busy road. It's going to be pretty much busy all the time. It's the entrance to the zoo. There. Pretty much all the animals will be bedded down now. I mean, they're not going to be out and on display at all anyway when the zoo's closed. I don't know what the protocols will be. I mean, there's still staff. Yeah, because obviously the animals have to be looked after. They can't be moved out of the zoo. Nice little daffodils there. On the other side of the fence. We can see the back part of the lake here. This is more of a nature reserve now, the back bit. Years ago, you could take your boat all the way to the end of the lake. But now you can't bring boats into this bit because it's just really the nature. car there. I like those little cars, those little Fiat's. If I ever learn to drive and get a car, I'd want something small like that, but I would want it in pink. Coming up to the lights now, we're actually getting close to the hospital. That's another reason why it's quite busy down here. see through the fence there's one up there and the other swans down there I doubt you'll be able to see them 
I don't think they've laid any eggs yet. I think it's a little early for swan eggs. I'm trying to think of when swans lay their eggs. Is it around May? Possibly. But I don't really know. If it was this mild, I guess they could lay eggs early. I really don't remember. But she looks like she's sitting on a nest. Look, I'll zoom in a little bit. feeding the peppers and they come out a bit and obviously you can tell I'm absolutely busy all that again okay? nowhere near her so even though I seem to be close up I didn't pop it at all Salisbury Woodland there. I do want to have a walk around there at some point. It's a place I really enjoy walking but it's getting a bit dark or it will be in the next 20 minutes or so. So I'm not really, you know, I don't think I'm going to walk down there. to the hospital now as well. If I time this right, I should get home before it gets really dark. And if you want me to come down to South Woodland and to a walk around there, just let me know in the comments and I will be happy to do that. I'm good passing the hospital now. I've got to say, I'm not a fan of hospitals. Spent a lot of time in there with myself and my relatives, and none of the times I've spent in hospitals were good memories. And I just want to clarify when I say that when I say all my hospital memories are bad ones, that's because of the situations that I was in or family members were in. Hospital and the staff can't fault them, they're nice and helpful and kind and hard working and doing their best to make your stay as publicly as possible but yeah, I'm not a fan of hospital at all that's where they've been doing the demolition which is more or less done now I did want to come down there and film but I've had too many places to film and check. But if you take a little look now, I mean, if I'm doing a Salisbury Woodland video tomorrow, I guess I could come there and do a bit of videoing around there. There's a golf course next to Stanley Park. We're right at the edge of the park perimeter now, so we'll be turning around. And it is starting to get a little bit darker, but it is going to be fine. I'll be home way before it gets dark, folks. And there we can see Blackpool Tower. You might not be able to see it yet, but you'll see it in a second.
there is the beautiful lady of Blackpool, the beautiful Blackpool Tower. Let's go on out again. Come on camera out you come. going to end this video now and I will start the next part right from where I stop it here so you won't be sleeping so once again thank you so much for watching please hit the like button please subscribe and maybe even leave me a comment as well and I will see you very soon in the next part goodbye